for today. It's not quite cold enough. Let's call it chilly this afternoon. The main reason is because it's so dull, very little in the way of sunshine. Now, there is mild weather out there in the Atlantic, very unsettled weather. You can see this area of low pressure, but it's sort of stuck here. And for the next few days, it's not going anywhere because high pressure is developing across Europe. And when you see this situation, the low pressures can't move in the direction of Europe. And you quite can, can see it quite clearly on the satellite picture. You can see this shield of cloud, which is associated with that area of the low pressure, tries to claw in, but it can't because of the area of high pressure. Now, there is a lot of clouds around across the UK today, but it's not because we've got weather fronts crossing the country. It's because we've got that low mass of grey within the area of high pressure. And also, with the moisture coming in off the sea, there's also going to be a little bit of drizzle in the air. So if you add the few things together, so the cloudy skies, the drizzle, the easterly breeze, and there is one developing, temperatures of 4 or 5 degrees, it feels on the chilly side. And also, in this situation, the further west you are, the brighter the weather will be. So, for example, across Cornwall, Devon, the western fringes of Wales, so from Pembrokeshire, the Clean Peninsula, into Anglesey, Snowdonia, perhaps a bit of brightness. But then again, once you get to Northern Ireland, where there's more of a sea fetch, again, it's cloudy. Now, what's going to happen tonight? Well, not an awful lot, because it's not going to change. The high pressure is still right over us. However, there's just the hint of possibly a few flakes of snow, or at least sleet, across the southeast of the country in temperatures of one or two degrees in city centres. And then here's the headline for this week. So what have we got? Well, one thing's for sure, it's going to turn colder and snow showers are on the horizon. Where's the cold air coming from? Well, it can only come from a couple of directions, from the north or the east. And you can see how the cold air is going to be flooding in across Europe as we go through the course of the week, all the way down into uh, France, in fact. So then, tomorrow, already a wintry flavour across East Anglia, the southeast, possibly even into the London area, might even see a couple of centimetres of snow, mainly across the hills, at least at this stage. Other than that, it's copycat conditions, it's a cloudy day and fairly chilly tomorrow. Now, let's have a look at the, the scene then on Tuesday. Again, we've got that high pressure stuck across the UK, so it's keeping all the weather fronts at bay out there in the Atlantic. And let's just say that in this meteorological situation, it means cold. I could get into all sorts of weather parameters for the weather enthusiasts, but let's just say that wintry showers will be affecting eastern coasts on Tuesday, possibly further inland as well. Clear skies on the cards too, so this is just an example of Tuesday night, just how cold it gets. Minus threes, fours, even minus five in one or two places, for example, in Chester. Now, Wednesday, what we're going to find is, with the flow, with the air coming in from the northeast, due southwest, an area of snow will develop across the North York Moors, sink towards the south and then the southwest. But, that's Wednesday night into the early hours of Thursday, but because we've got an area of high pressure still over us, in this sort of situation, any areas of snow or lines of snow that do move around across the UK tend to fizzle out by the time they get to Western Britain. But this is just an indication that on Thursday, snow flurries almost anywhere, be it light ones mostly. Then on Friday, it's copycat conditions for many of us. It's cold temperatures of one or two degrees with one or two flurries. I think the basic message this week is that the further east you live and the southeast, the more likely you to get this. 